Long gone are the days my buff, shiny black leather shoes clopped and strutted up the Paris end of Collins Street. Cashmere and Italian label designer suit contouring over my broad held shoulders, giving strength and fortitude in my step. A loft in my chest and an importance in valour rising like the elevator swooshing up 40 floors of a high prominent tower. Up on high, sun glistening through the frosty bespeckled windows, eyes lightly squinted as the glare hit the floor to ceiling glass. My toes abut, nose and lips all but pressed against it, my necktie dangling from its broad half Windsor knot, mouth craving the cool, crisp oxygen swirling amongst the clouds on the other side of the hardened glass. A decade or more since, it's now 8.30am Thursday on a bright winter's morning, barely 10 degrees in the air and any more I don't even know who I was standing at that window, seemingly a foreign life lived. My board shorts contour over my thighs, lightly motioning as the black shiny fins effortlessly caress the cool 13 degrees sea and the calm silence of the southern ocean waters. The light northerly wind presses down on the sea surface, the soft southwesterly swell sent from Antarctica, contented in its rare muted state. Bright green carpets, sashes of gold and yellow, flickers of brown, pink and white pass beneath me, bare skin delighting in the flow of this sheer blue liquid enveloping me, nose and eyes hidden behind the black and clear mask that is my window to this underwater theatre. With a soothing easy inhalation, my chest inflates, my lips close ever so softly, and with a light roll forward, my head leads the way for the body to immerse in the wealth of the world. Pressing the water, the fins steer me downwards until I plateau and rest on the rocky reef, kelp strands and seaweed adorning my physique as if tailored to be one for a moment. A peace permeates my being, accentuated as the greetings of the fish proximus extend their welcome and meeting their eyes with mine. Not one thing matters in mind, held in this sweet eternity of just being, of being in absolute union, immersed deftly under the sea.